Dylan Drummond out of uh, Eastern Michigan, oh, it is right? Mm-hmm. I, I kind of I was trying to like, uh, summarize the things that I saw out of him that made him special or made him a story coming out of training camp. But I, I think it's more because uh, positioning to, to make these catches and I feel like he's always got an opportunity to make the catch, no matter like where it is. What have you seen from him, and and how do you make uh, make of this training camp for him? Oh, spectacular! I think that this is I'm on Ross St. Brown 2.0. Um, we had an opportunity to catch up with his former coach, uh, Coach Creighton, at, out of Eastern Michigan. And when he was at Lions camp, he said, and he told a group of reporters, he said, this is a player that you want to have. He does everything right, one of the good guys. And you can see why. A player that maybe not the most gifted talently, but has the ability to work hard, can utilize the skill set that he does have in order to see the field. And you can just see the fruits of his labor. He stays after practice. And I talked to him today after practice, and I said, you know, what does that bring to you when you're staying out here after practice catching balls? And he's like, look, every single day is an opportunity to get better. And if there's an opportunity to get even a half percent better each and every day, then you stack those days, and then you put yourself in a position to really make it tough for the coaching staff to cut you. At this point, I would put him on the 53-man roster. I think he embodies everything that you want in a player. He works hard. He catches the football. He's open. Jared Goff has a connection with him. He's definitely somebody that makes plays, but I think that you also need to see what he can do uh, in live competition. I think that he's going to benefit from these three preseason games. Early on in one-on-ones against the Giants, they did uh, the defensive backs did lock him down for a couple reps, but once he got into rhythm on day one, boy, he was, he was a player that was tough to stop. And all you can say about a player is, is he able to adapt and adjust? And guys, you're reading it day after day after day. All we're talking about is Dylan Drummond offensively because he makes plays and he's all over the field.